Well, good morning out there, everybody. As we take a live look from the tower camera, you'll see we do have some cloud cover out there right now. That cloud cover will clear this afternoon with sunshine taking over. We do have some storms out there still, though. A flash flood watch still in effect for some of our e eastern and southern parishes closer towards New Orleans. Gonzalez included in that, but you'll notice East Baton Rouge Parish, West Baton Rouge Parish, Point Capi Parish, even north towards west and east Fleet Shanna Parish. All those parishes have been removed from the flash flood watch. No chance of seeing rain left for today. But man, it has it been a wet week. Here's a look at the rain totals over the past week. We've seen almost 10 inches of rain just south of Donaldsonville. Some areas near Thibodeau, six to seven inches. Baton Rouge, some areas have seen up to seven inches of rain. So it's certainly been a wet week, but we are going to be drying out here. You can see uh, there's a front moving through right now and the rain's beginning to exit the region. We have had a new line of showers and storms popping up, but that front's going to be pushing them out here soon. But as we take a look at the uh, closer look at some of those thunderstorms that are going off right now, you can see a pretty good thunderstorm just moved through Thibodeau right now. Thibodeau starting to get lighter rain, but heavier rain beginning to fall here in Laplace and Laplace had a flash flood warning yesterday, so you know, they can't handle much more water there. And so with this training over them for the next, say, hour, could be a bit of an issue for Laplace. I'll have to watch that one closely. But Gonzalez is seeing some light rain at the moment. Baton Rouge is sitting dry. But notice we do still have a couple areas of you know, a few sprinkles still possible over Baton Rouge just for the next hour. Temperature is sitting in the 70s right now, 71 in Baton Rouge, much cooler to the north, 67 in Liberty, 64 in Woodville, 73 down in Gonzales right now, just seeing some light rain. Winds are coming in pretty light right now and from the northwest. Looks like today we're going to see a high of about 84 in Baton Rouge, 84 as well for high in Clinton. New roads probably reaching 85, 84. 85 as well in uh, Greensburg today. South of the 1012 corridor, those temperatures are going to stay pretty much the same as north of the 1012 corridor. So a high of 86 in Port Vincent, 85 for a high today in Thibodeau. Timing out these showers and storms, they're going to continue to stay towards the south and east from Baton Rouge. Everyone north and west of Baton Rouge will be completely clear, but those storms will eventually exit. This is 9 o'clock. We're only seeing one or two storms left over New Orleans at that time. Once we hit the lunch hour, we should see nothing but sunshine, and we'll keep that sunshine with us for the rest of the day today. Rain chances will be going down for the rest of the forecast, and we'll stay out of the forecast all the way through Memorial Day. But the day after Memorial Day, we could see isolated shower chances returning in that forecast. A so look at your day planner today. We're drying out this morning. We'll see clearing clouds and sunshine taking over. It'll be a pretty quiet evening as well. Highs won't be too hot, though, so it's going to feel pretty comfortable today, only reaching maybe 83 or 84 degrees today. So it looks like uh, the rest of the forecast is still going to stay sunny. We're talking all the way up to 88, maybe 90 degrees on Sunday. Then Monday, we got Memorial Day. I got to move over that little icon there. It's covering up the text on Tuesday. Whoops, a daisy. Uh, but uh, you can see Monday and Tuesday certainly getting warm and then the showers return the day after Memorial Day. As for traffic, traffic isn't looking